I found that Pilates will tone, strengthen and scalp. Apa you nak? You want this? You want this? You know? It will actually... But it doesn't do cardio. Okay, macam saya buat Pilates ya. Dah, udah, this is coming to 11 years. Ever since I gave birth to my last baby at 42 years old. Yeah, what year was that? 2004. Eh, Kali, Kali, uh, Khalifa is 2007. Sorry, 2007. Then I started with Pilates because yeah, kita kan sudah berusia and I cannot do all that jumping, jumping exercise anymore. You know what I mean? So I wanted something that is slow but would work. So I started with Pilates sebab saya, I found that Pilates will tone, strengthen and scalp. Apa you nak? You want this? You want this? You know? It will actually, but it doesn't do cardio. Cardio you kena buat separate. You know? So, I am so malas to exercise, okay? Orang kalau bilang, oh aku harus work out, aku, tidak, aku tak boleh fikir, aku rasa nak cekik dia. Like, I pergi tidur lah. You know? Like, you know? But, I have to do it because of my work. I don't work 9 to 5 in a in a kantor. So there are days when I'm busy, there are days when I'm not. So when I'm not busy, what do I do? Exercise lah because that is for my stamina, it's for my work. Okay, 30 minutes 3 times a week and pilates is twice a week 1 hour per session. Tetapi, wait. I am not the sort that must be 3 times a week. Kalau sibuk Paling paling pun at least once a week, 30 minutes. But uh, please don't follow me because I have been doing it consistently from so long because of my work and it keeps me trim, you know. But this is the this is the advice that I'm telling lady women: start slow, ikut kemampuan. As you get stronger, you add on, you know, the time, you know, and don't look at the weighing scale. Just do it. Tell yourself, at least I want to do this. Kalau paling-paling sibuk pun, at least once a week lah. Okay? And keep it up. Make sure you keep it up. Because then you will see the results when your friends tell you you're looking good. Eh, kamu ni kelihatan ya, berseri ya. Apa ya, ya? And you pun tinggi, eh, apa yang I buat eh? There's no proper ritual like a secret ritual that you do. That, eh, why is my friend saying I'm looking good? So, you know what I mean? And like, this is already December. Can you imagine if you have started it in January? That's 12 months that you've done it. So, stop thinking and do it. Tomorrow. On a elliptical machine, yang tak ada impact, it's like running on air. And that's just outside my bedroom. Okay. I wake up in the morning, I brush my teeth and I can look like hell. <laughs> and I go on that. Because if I go to the gym, half the time orang mau foto. Macam mana nak exercise? And then you look like hell. <laughs> Might as well do it at home. <laughs> so everything must be in moderation. Seimbang. Even though kita belajar ya, kalau I'm eating in excess is bad. So kalau makan tu, ya perut saya pun kecil ya. Banyak mana nak makan. But I don't diet. I eat everything. There's no such thing. But I need to cut down my sugar actually now that I'm older. But yeah, I I love my rice. Sorry ya. Orang bilang no carbo whatever. I will need the most is tiga hari tanpa nasi. After the third day, I need my rice or I'll murder somebody. <laughs> yeah, I need. I am real Melayu Asia sambal terasi person. Okay. So uh, yeah, uh, no uh, unless like macam on the day of the show. I know that kalau sudah lebih dekat time show, I cannot, tak boleh telan ya, kita nervous ya. You know when you're nervous, you can't eat, right? So, my lunch will be big. It will be a steak or something like that. Heavy. And then my and then my last meal is dinner will be either pukul 5 atau pukul 6 sebelum maghrib. That will be sandwich atau apa. Because I cannot eat rice anymore, it's too much kan? And then just before I go on stage, katalah if I still feel that I need something, it will be a banana and yogurt. Yang cepat, yang senang ni, uh, to digest. And then if I'm hungry, maybe after the show lah. <laughs>